Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna actually be doing a hygiene slash pamper vlog today. So I am gonna be shopping for some more hygiene products. And then I'm also going to be doing a like a whole pamper routine. I'm excited, we're gonna get cute, pamper ourselves, spoil ourselves, and get some good products. I found a lot of new products that I wanna try. So yeah, I'm gonna be showing you guys all the new products that I'm getting. And then I'm gonna show you guys how I pamper myself and get myself cute. I gotta get my nails done, which I don't really get my nails done. I'm gonna start doing press-ons because like press-ons are actually really cute and they last a while and then I'm going to actually go get my toes done um, but I don't know where because I am very picky with getting my toes done or my nails done which is why I don't get my nails done anymore I just get press-ons so yeah I'm gonna go get my toes done but I'm gonna do a little like mini facial session at home I have like a seamer face mask and everything and that's pretty much it I'm just gonna take you guys along with me but yeah I'll just catch up with you guys after I get my food so this camera don't keep sliding around so the first store that we're gonna go in is called fresh time it's just this really really healthy food store um, but it also has like a lot of really good body care stuff in there as well. So I really want to see if they had this goat milk bar soap and then also some exfoliating gloves. So yeah, we're going to go in here really quick. So these are the little goat soaps. They have a lot of different ones. This one is lavender, charcoal, and lemongrass, almond, honey. And then they have a lot more um, over here as well. So yeah, these are what I was talking about. These are so freaking cool, you guys. I think I want to try this one. I think I'm going to do one of these. This one is almond goat's milk. And then I kind of want to do this one right here. Yes, I think I want to do this one. So, yeah, these are so cool. They're made out of goat's milk, you guys. And they also have all of these, like, body lotions and hair conditioner and shampoo. Just really good brands. Um, it's just like a really healthy, healthy store. They even have Shea Moisture. I didn't even know that. But um, yeah. They got the Dr. Browners. Every store has that, I feel like. So. And then they have more little soaps over here too. Oh, these are so cute. This one's oatmeal. That is crazy. And then they have almond. Sandalwood. Mm, that is so crazy. They have these up here too. These ones are like goat's milk. This one's lavender, oatmeal lavender, sandalwood citrus, lavender mint, lavender rosemary. But yeah, they have a lot. This almond one, I want to smell that. Ooh, this smells so good. But yeah, and then they have more of the little soaps up here too. This one's my fave. But yeah. And then I found the little exfoliating gloves. I think I'm gonna do the pink ones. Um, but they have a lot of different choices. They have these little, it says it's a loofah in the raw. And then they also have brushes over here as well for your back and things like that. So yeah. Got my goodies. So we finally got everything we needed out of Fresh Time. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to the next store. I think I'm actually gonna go get my toes done because it's already 12, 11. So I'm just gonna get my toes done and out of the way before it gets a little bit later on in the day. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that now and head to the nail salon. And then I'm gonna go try to find my little press on nails. And there's like a certain one that I want, but I don't know where they are. Like I don't know what store. So I'm gonna have to try a couple different stores. I think I'm gonna go to Walmart today, you guys, and just give in and see what they have. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and head over to the nail salon and then I'll just see you guys once I get there.
I just got done getting my toes done, as you guys seen. Now I'm actually about to head to Walmart so I can find my little press-on nails. After that, I'm gonna run to a couple different stores to try to get some more hygiene products. And then we're going to put my nails on. And then I'm gonna show you guys all my little goodies that I got. Yeah, I'll probably just see you guys once I get to Walmart. I found all of the nails. And these are the ones I'm gonna get. But, um... I wanted the ones that were real short and they don't have the real short ones. They just have medium and then they have short. So I don't know if I should do short or medium because these look a little bit more natural than those ones. Yeah, they have a lot of cute options though. They have these really cute glitter ones. Um, these ones, let's see. They just have a lot of different colors and designs. I even thought these were cute. So yeah, they have a lot of cute different nail designs. So I've also been wanting to get one of these brushes for my back so I can get my back clean. So I'm actually gonna grab one of these as well. I found another tree hut scrub. It's called Sugared Fantasy. It smells so good, you guys. I have to get it. And then I also found this cotton candy one as well. I think I'm actually gonna have to grab both because they smell so freaking good, you guys. Oh my goodness. They're so cute. And then there's this one too, but I'm more interested in that one and this one so yeah this one's the cotton candy shea sugar scrub and it smells amazing but i really love the neutrogena body oil it just really makes your body feel so freaking soft you guys and then their little rainforest um body wash that goes with it smells really good too this stuff you guys i heard is really good for shaving it helps with like razor bumps and then it just is really smooth on the skin so this is just the johnson's shea and cocoa butter oil gel so I'm gonna grab some of that. And then I see this a lot on a lot of people's channels, so I'm definitely gonna have to grab this. It doesn't even really smell like coffee. It really smells like vanilla and coffee mixed. It smells so freaking good, you guys. Like, oh, I have to grab this. The other one that I wanted to try to smell was this Native Body Wash Coconut Vanilla. I haven't seen this one in the store yet because it's always sold out, but a lot of people say it smells so good. Mm, it's okay not all that but another one i wanted to smell were these olay ones this is the olay moisture ribbons plus shea and manuka honey so let's see Ooh, that smells good they also have a lavender one let's try that that smells so good this is shea and lavender oil this one actually smells really good and then this one is shea and notes of blue lotus so it looks like that Ooh, yeah, y'all, these smell amazing. I think I actually might get the lavender. I think the lavender was my favorite. Let me smell them again. That smells so freaking good. I thought the shea and the honey would be my favorite. Actually, it is my favorite. Mm-hmm. Smells amazing. And then I also see a lot of these as well in people's videos. So I think I'm going to do this one. I read all of them and I feel like the pink bottle is the one that I honestly like the most. But yeah, there's a couple different options. So I'm going to grab this. They have these Epsom salt baths for babies and kids. So um, this one is elderberry and vitamin C with essential oils. And then this is the Dr. Teal's gentle Epsom bath sleep soak with melatonin and essential oils. I have the bath wash for this one. But I don't have the Epsom salt. I think I want to do this one. Also, I grab little baby wipes for my hoo-ha, you know, down there. Um, I usually get the ones that are 99% water. So I use that to clean up down there on days that I just am rushing to get out the house. So, yeah, they have a lot of different options. But these ones are definitely my favorite right there. So, yeah. So I got all of my things from Walmart. Gonna put these in the car. So we're currently outside of Ulta. We're gonna go in here and see if they have that little leg scrub that I was trying to find. I found the scrub. Um, this is the KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub. This stuff is supposed to work amazing. I also found some EOS Shave Cream. This is Pink Citrus, Pomegranate Raspberry, Vanilla Bliss. And then they also have those ones as well. This one's Oatmeal and Coconut Oil. And I've never seen shave oil before, but they literally have shave oil by the Tree Hut. Oh my gosh, you guys. And this is Vanilla Bean. And they have Coconut Lime. And then um, Moroccan Rose as well. This is how my toes look, you guys. Got just a French manicure. Super simple, classy. And now I'm about to put my little press-ons on. See how these turn out.
I just finished my my nails. They look so cute. I think I did a good job for the first time me putting press-ons on. So I'm about to see my face and then do a face mask. So I'm just gonna show you guys what little products I'm using. This is a steamer that I use. This is just from Amazon. Basically, you just take this little compartment out right here. You fill it up with water, put it back in, and then you'll plug in, you know, the cord to the wall. And then you just press this little button and then the steam will start coming out. The steam really does penetrate the skin and really gets in my skin to get those blackheads out. And then it really does work on my whiteheads too, as you guys can see. I just popped this one. I was trying to leave it alone, but it was really irritating me. So um, I feel like after I pop them and then I steam, it really gets in there to like really push everything out and just really get all the bacteria out of my skin. So I really love to steam. So I'm gonna do that. Before I steam, I'm actually gonna wash my face. The face wash I've been loving lately is this Derma E Acne Deep Pore Cleansing Wash. Looks like this. So, yeah, I love this facial wash. It has tea tree oil in it and salicylic acid and chamomile. So tea tree oil is really good for if you have, you know, acne prone skin. And it's also vegan and cruelty free, non-GMO. It's really good ingredients, you guys. I really like this brand. Ever since I've been using this, I feel like my skin has been a lot clearer. It's been like going away. A lot of my big pimples that I usually get aren't really popping up as much. So yeah, I use this and I kind of broke the top. The mask I'm gonna be using is this vitamin C clay mask. I believe it's by Gleeman. This is what it looks like. I like this mask too. This mask is really good for hyperpigmentation or dark spots. So this one has turmeric and aloe vera in it and it says it instantly enhances skin for a luminous bare face glow, stain free and formulated to work with all skin types. I got this offline. I believe it was like almost $40. This is what the inside looks like. Um, it's just a yellowish kind of mask just because it does have turmeric in it. Turmeric is really good for dark spots, hyperpigmentation. As you guys can see, I have dark spots over here, over here, so on my forehead, my chin. I'm going to be using that to kind of help, you know, fade away my dark spots over time. Yeah, let me stop talking and go ahead and get right into this little facial skincare routine. A tip from the dermatologist that I'm going to share with you guys is when you are washing your face, you want to at least wash your face for the whole duration of a song. So usually I'll put a song on and I'll just quickly, you know, just go over my face, scrub them like this, and I'll just do it for the whole entire song. Sometimes even a two minute song. So yeah, 60 seconds, really working the product in your skin to really get it deep into your pores. Say I just put this on my skin and I'm just like this and I'm done. What did that just do for you? Nothing. It just sat on top of your skin. It didn't really penetrate deep into the skin cells. So yeah, you want to at least really just keep this on for 60 seconds massaging your face and really going over all the areas that you have problems with so that's what i do that's a little trick for you guys if you guys didn't know that already and then also another trick is after you're done washing your face and your face is still wet use a paper towel to dry your skin just because it doesn't have bacteria sitting in it already like my towel would so say um someone came in the bathroom and wiped their hands off with the towel after they clean their towel you don't know what they're doing in the bathroom touching this towel with or wiping the towel off with the sink after you're done washing your face. So you're just gonna want to use a paper towel to dry your face. And honestly, I feel like my skin is just more cleaner when I use a paper towel because there's literally nothing on the paper towel. No bacteria just sitting in there, no germs. So that's what I do. And for my steamer, I'm gonna go ahead and fill up the little water compartment thing. Um, and I only use bottled water to do that just because it does say use filtered water or distilled water, whatever you want to use. Let's go ahead and fill this up. I'm done steaming my face. My face feels so fresh and clean. I'm going to go ahead and apply my mask and leave this on for about 10 minutes because it says 10 minutes on here. And then I will check back in with you guys. my bags here of everything that I got and I'm just going to show you guys all of my little goodies and my hygiene products that I got. So this first thing I got from Ulta is just this KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub and this is with 10% AHA. This I've seen on a lot of girls channels that do hygiene videos and it's really good for strawberry legs and just ingrown hairs, razor bumps. So I bought this to kind of help with that. And the next thing I got is from Walmart. So all of these next products are going to be from Walmart. So this is the Tree Hut Cotton Candy Shea Sugar Scrub. This smells so freaking good and the color of it is just so pretty. I see this on a lot of people's channels as well. So yeah, I had to get this. 
The next thing that I got is from the Tree Hut as well. This is the Sugared Fantasy Shea Sugar Scrub. This one actually smells amazing. Like this one kind of smells like vanilla and it smells so freaking good. And he has these like little beads in it to help with exfoliating. Grab that one as well. For my baby, I just grabbed this Dr. Teal's Kids Gentle Epsom Bath. This one has elderberry and vitamin C with essential oils. So yeah, I grabbed that for her. Next thing I got is this Olay Moisture Ribbons Plus Body Wash. And this one is the Shea with Notes of Manuka Honey. This stuff smells so good and it's also aesthetically pleasing as well. I feel like this is going to be more creamier than a like sudsy soap. But I would definitely let you guys know how I feel about this one. This next one I am really excited about. This is the OGX Coconut Coffee Scrub and Wash. So I'm going to have to use this like today. <laughs> But yeah, I grabbed this one, and you guys, it really does smell so freaking good. So, I grabbed that. Next thing I just grabbed is this Neutrogena Body Oil. This one is the Light Sesame Formula. Basically, I just will go in after I get out of my shower while I'm still a little wet and just add body oil all over my skin just to give my skin a nice glow and to feel super soft and moisturized. And then I'll go in with lotion after this. So, yeah, I grabbed this. The next thing I grabbed is this Eco Tools Bath Brush. I think that's what you call it, um, or shower brush. Um, basically, you just use this to really get all of the soap and everything on your back so that your back can be washed really good as well. So I grabbed one of these. I believe this was like $3, so... Yeah, I got that. And then I grabbed this TheraBreath Dentist Formulated Healthy Smile Aura Rinse. I see this on a lot of people's channels as well. I haven't used this yet. So this one says it fights cavities for 24 hours, strengthens teeth, and improves their appearance, and it freshens your breath. And I got Sparkle Mint. They have a lot of different varieties of these, but I felt like this one was the one that I was going to like the most, so I grabbed this one. And then the next thing I grabbed is just this Johnson's Oil Gel. This one is the Shea and Cocoa Butter. This stuff is so good to shave with, you guys. Like, I'm obsessed with this. It's so good to shave with. It leaves your legs feeling so smooth and so soft. This next thing that I grabbed are these Hello Bello Wipes. And I use these for my hoo-ha just because these are 99% water. And the other wipes that I was using, I think they were from like a toilet paper brand. They were just mostly like a lot of other ingredients in there. Use some of these so you guys can freshen up whenever you're out and about. And I also had to grab some cotton swab. I like to keep my ears clean. And then I also use this for some of my skincare products to apply to my face. So I just grabbed these, but yeah, keep your ears clean, and you can even use this with um, some alcohol to clean out your belly button as well, so yeah, grab those. And these next products are all going to be from Fresh Time. It's just a little local store that I have that sells really healthy foods and soaps and body wash and everything like that. This is the first soap that I got. This one is the Almond Goat's Milk, and it feels so good on your skin, you guys. Like, after I'm done touching this, I rub my fingers together, and it's so, so soft and so smooth. Like, it's just really good for your skin. Goat milk has a lot of benefits and they make the soap bars look so cute too. So I got one of these ones. This next one is the Oats and Honey Bar Soap. This one is really pretty too. They just put a lot of detail into these soaps and they're really good for your skin. So yeah, if you guys have a fresh time near you, definitely pick some of these up because they're really good for your skin. And then this last thing that I grabbed from there are these exfoliating gloves. I've seen these on a lot of people's channels as well and I feel like they're so, so good for exfoliating the skin. I feel like this really just gets deep into the skin follicles and really just helps to get that new skin on the surface and get rid of the dead skin so i grabbed those that is everything that i got you guys i hope you guys like this one it was a little different for my other video i kind of showed you guys like how i kind of pamper myself and get myself looking cute and feeling cute again and then i also picked up some products as well if you guys do like these videos don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video guys bye